Welcome, fellow thrill seekers, to the darkest corners of cinema. Prepare to be terrified as we unveil the bone-chilling lineup of horror that awaits us in the second season of Wednesday. Today we will talk about everything new updates about Wednesday Season 2 so far. Stay tuned to the last of the video. Who is joining Wednesday Season 2? Wednesday's world, or at least family, is going to get a little bit bigger in Season 2. During Tudum, a global fan event, Ortega, Dewan, Myers, and Sunday debated the spookiest Wednesday fan theories. Topics of discussion included the possible looming danger of Joseph Crackstones, William Houston, Ring, and a suspected mystery around Lurches, George Bercia, identity, though nothing is known about those things for certain. However, the cast did confirm one viewer hunch. A new Adams family member is on their way to Wednesday. While Dewan says he and his co-stars have no idea which new Adams will darken the series' door, that doesn't mean they don't have ideas. Ortega has her fingers crossed cousin ITT will shuffle his way into Nevermore. While Dewan and Sunday agree, they would love to meet Wednesday's grandmother. Is there a Wednesday Season 2 trailer? When can I watch it? Still now there is no trailer as the series is in production. We're in for a long wait, but if Wednesday's persistent investigation has taught us anything, it's that patience will be rewarded. We will, of course, be at the forefront of all the latest Wednesday updates, so keep checking in. Will there be a Wednesday spinoff? Rumors have been circulating that Netflix is working on an Uncle Fester spinoff. Reportedly, the streaming service is hoping to expand Wednesday into a wider universe, which means several more Adams Family shows could follow. If the whispers are to be believed, the spin-off is in the very early stages of discussion and talent and storyline details are still being fleshed out, which means we're still a long way from anything concrete. Wednesday Season 2 Potential Release Date When's it back? Wednesday Season 2 will not be returning to Netflix until 2025. This disappointing news came via Deadline, who reported that its release had been pushed back along with other hits such as One Piece Season 2 and Stranger Things Season 5. As disappointing as this may seem, there is good news. Production is on track and is rumored to begin on April 30th at its new location home in Ireland. Wednesday was previously shot in Romania, which gave the country a tourism boost in the wake of the show's massive global success. The delay is likely related to production grinding to a halt in 2023 because of the Hollywood strikes. While things may be back to business for many, there was bound to be a knock-on effect, especially for shows like Wednesday that need budget time for that stunning VFX work. Netflix officially confirmed in January 2023 that the show would be returning for a second season, mere months after season one came out in November 2022. Let's hope the production schedule doesn't follow the same autumn release pattern as the debut season. All things panning out well, we'd expect a spring 2025 release date at the latest. Wednesday Season 2 Plot What will happen? The plot for Wednesday Season 2 is tightly under wraps, almost as if Wednesday herself had a hand in binding it. However, despite Netflix's tight-lipped approach, Ortega has let slip that Season 2 will have more viral moments than Ortega's self-composed prom dance. Ortega told Vanity Fair, I mean, in the first season we had episodes that really stood out visually, like the dance episode was a really big one for people, and that setting was very particular and it felt like prom night. A little bit, or Carrie? She added, every episode, of season two, that I've read so far is like that. It just stands out on its own as a very memorable scene or bit or setting, which I think is what I'm most excited for, because to pull that off for eight episodes is, I think, really incredible and really lucky. Intrigued? Well, we won't get much more than that for now, but that doesn't mean there's not plenty to ponder over between now and that 2025 release date. Loose strings were left flapping in the breeze at the end of Wednesday, season one, and they need addressing, urgently. Wednesday's discovery that her boyfriend was the monster terrorizing Nevermore is the kind of heartbreak she didn't seem to revel in, despite her penchant for pain. As a double dose of betrayal, he was being controlled by teacher favorite Miss Thornhill, who turned out to be a bitter normie who had an axe to grind with the outcasts. We doubt that Tyler will continue to be Ms. Thornhill's controlled pet, but we're almost certain he escaped. And we're even more sure that he'll resurface in Wednesday's life. As a friend, lover, or foe, though, is yet to be determined. Wednesday Season 2 cast, who will be coming back? It's unfathomable not to have Wednesday and her right-hand hand thing return for Season 2, so it's no surprise that Ortega, as part of the announcement, is reprising her role. Wednesday's almost love interest Xavier Thorpe, played by Percy Hines White, is also bound to join Season 2. Rebuffed but not forgotten, Xavier may have a shot now that Tyler is out of the picture. Or is he? When we last saw Wednesday's sort of boyfriend turn villain, he was detained. 
but something tells us that the guttural growl he emitted at the end of season one could lead to a breakout. If that's the case, we fully expect Hunter Dewan to jump back into his hide skin for season two. Catherine Zeta-Jones officially confirmed her return as Morticia Adams in June, and we suspect the following will round out the Wednesday season two cast. Emma Myers as Enid Sinclair, a Joy Sunday as Bianca Barkley, a George Farmer as Ajax Petropolis, a Naomi J. Ogawa as Yoko Tanaka, a Jamie McShane as Sheriff Donovan Galpin, Ethan Luis Guzman as Gomes Adandas, a Isaac Ordonez as Pugsley Adams, a Fred Armisen as Uncle Fester. Has Wednesday's season two villain been revealed? However, Hunter Dewan, who plays Tyler, certainly has his theories on the fate of his character. Speaking to Digital Spy in an exclusive interview, he said he was certain Tyler managed to evade the clutches of the law. I do think he escaped at the end. When I read that on the page, I was so excited. I was like, come on, don't be dead, don't be dead, he said. When it comes to which version of Tyler, good or bad, we could see in season two, Dewan's remark about his season one arc does shed some light. I think he was being controlled by Miss Thornhill, said Dewan. Then he had to go manipulate Wednesday to carry out their plan, and I think he did a pretty good job with it. If he was indeed being manipulated, it could mean that redemption is on the cards for him. There could be other villains worth keeping an eye on, however. A few times, the show name-dropped the ominous presence of the Morning Songs, a cult-like group run by Bianca's siren mother, capable of luring in new members. Bianca's mother coerced her into agreeing to join them, to strengthen their persuasive call. There's surely room and scope to elevate the Morning Songs to main villain status in Wednesday Season 2. Watch this space. One thing that definitely needs clearing up is the identity of the mystery texter. Not long after Xavier gifts Wednesday a brand new phone, she receives a cryptic, threatening text message complete with stalker wife photos of herself. The sender? Well, that's unknown. But it's just the kind of danger that's sure to light Wednesday's soul on fire. It's also something that will certainly help set the wheels of a Season 2 story in motion. Thank you, fellow Thrill Seekers, for joining us on this dark journey through the anticipated second season of Wednesday. From secret trysts to grand balls, we've explored it all, but the drama doesn't end here. Remember to mark your calendars. Filming for Season 2 is scheduled to begin in late April 2024, and we're in for a spine-tingling ride. If you've enjoyed our gossip-filled escapade, Hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more Wednesday goodness. And as Lady Whistledown would say, the pin is mightier than the sword, and the quill is mightier than the dagger. Until next time, my fellow fans of the macabre, may your tea be strong, your wits sharper, and your heart ever hopeful.